any material scientist under the conditions I'm working. I'm telling you, it's Spock. Bare skins and stone knives. You put this in a lab, you put this under uh, uh, proper industrial uh, 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 mechanized uh, machinery where it's done uniform and you're going to increase the strength and the properties of Vulcan IH by at least 20%. Could you comprehend that? I mean, look what I just did. It's beyond comprehension. Look at people. Come on. Come on. This is not a joke. Look at, look at, look at, look at, look, look, look at it coming back. Look, look. That's, that's one of the materials. That's not a crack. That's a material inside there. That's a specific material. Look, look, look at it. Do you see any cracks and tears? That was a complete bend. Please tell me if you see any cracks or tears. People, I can do this test again and again and again. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do it again and again. I'm going to do it one more time just to show you because I'm so tired of people. I'm so tired of people looking. Look at, look at, I mean, come on, folks. Look at, look at, there's, look at, there's no cracks. Look, I'm going to do it again. I'm going to do it again just to say piss on you. Here we go. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. It'll come back. It takes 10 minutes to come back. I'm shaking. I'm, 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 I'm so proud of myself. You know, I've been at this for 22 years. And I know what I have. Look at this. It's already coming back. Look at that. That was a complete bend. Look at That's what it does. It's only been what? I'm telling you. You saw it. Two minutes? Within 10 minutes, it comes back to 98% of its original shape. Now, you watch this. This is the ultimate test. This is the one that separates the boys from the men. I'm going to take the exact same sample. It's been uncut film. You saw it. This is the exact same sample. You just saw me. Not a tear. Not a crack. Not a split. Nothing. Nothing. And I beat it. 60% lighter. 375 PSI. Look, I'm so nervous. I don't know what I'm doing. I, I, I did it. I knew I could do it. And I'm working. I'm working in our kit conditions. Now, I'm going to do the same bend test again with the same sample. The same two samples that I put together, I'm going to do the same, the same test again and show you that it has lost almost none of its strength. Now that's unprecedented. That, you find me a metal. You find me an alloy. You find me a composite material that after a full bend test, and now I'm talking 60% lighter than steel. Carbon fiber, please, tell me, tell me, tell me. On a full bend test, that you, look at this, I don't even know what I'm doing, I'm so nervous, I'm so excited, that you, can, that you can reuse it again. The same sample within 10 minutes on the same bend test and lose almost no strength. Here we go, here it is, here it is. This is about five minutes and it's about 80% back to its original shape. Here we go, look at this, look at this, this is unbelievable. Unbelievable, like come on people. You got, you got to go with me here. Here. It's the same sample. 136 to 137. It's the exact same sample. Oh, my goodness. I'm absolutely... I don't know what to say. I, I'm stunned. Look at it. Look at it. It's almost back. It's almost back. Look. Look. Look at it. Look. Please look at it. It's almost back to its original shape. That's been about six minutes. Six minutes. It's almost back to its original shape. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, to the, thank you, everybody. Like, I mean, this, this, this is huge. This is huge. And again, I, 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 I can't show you. Here's what I went up against. Here's the big daddy. 355 grams. And I beat that son of a bitch. I beat it. I beat it. But look at the difference. Look at the difference. There's your big daddy. It ain't never coming back. 3 8 plate steel, 4 by 2 It ain't never coming back. Look at my Vulcanite. It's almost back already. It's almost back already. Look at the difference. Absolutely staggering. Here we go. We're going to do it again. This is seven minutes, people. Seven minutes. Seven, eight minutes in between the test. Here we go. Here we go. You saw me do it. Uncut film. Seven to eight minutes in between. And I'm going to do it on the back end. Which makes it even worse because you're doing this. You're doing this, which is incredibly important. This is what you're doing. You want to break something? You don't go like this. You go like this. Like that. And that's what I'm doing with this piece. You saw me do the bend test on the front face side. Now I'm going to do it on the back face side. Unbelievable. I'm shaking. I did it. I knew I could do it. I knew I had it. I knew I had the wonder material. I got it. You saw it. Fireproof people. Acid proof people. Oh, UV resistant. Dirt cheap. Seven dollars a square foot at a quarter inch thick. Unbelievable and a reflex memory of 98% with almost nothing in weight of strike reduction. Here we go. Here we go. Same sample. Same sample. Same sample. 60% lighter than the Big Daddy. 60% lighter. That 
bent at 325 PSI. This one on the first bend test. Remember, we're using this a second time. See, I can't keep saying this enough because people don't comprehend it, but a material scientist will. I'm using the same sample on a same bend test within seven minutes. Watch. Here we go. Here we go. I shouldn't get. Look, I know, I know, I know I'm repeating myself, but this is how it should be, people. Look, look, this is how it should be. You take a composite material, you do it on a bend test, this didn't even register, and it's 50 layers of xylem. But, 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 negate that. The fact is, that's it. Do you see how it loses its strength? That's what's supposed to happen. Carbon fiber, it shatters, it cracks, it breaks, you can't use it again. Science says without refute that the same sample that I'm using shouldn't even register 5 PSI. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, same sample. Come on, baby, don't let me down. Here we go, look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this, are you kidding me? Look at this, look at this. Come on, come on, baby, come on. Look at that, 350 PSI, damn near. Look at this, look at this, look at that. Unbelievable, same, 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 whoa. It just snapped off the end. It didn't break, it just it just flipped off the, uh, the, uh, uh, the bar, woohoo. Didn't break, don't panic, didn't break. It's only three inches long, or four inches long, so it snapped off the bar. You see how it snapped off the bar? Or I could have even had a bigger uh, a rating on the PSI. So, what did we have? You saw it, you saw it. Whew. Oh, 325 PSI on film, uncut. So what does that say? That the first bend test, at 60% lighter, I beat. 3 8 plate steel by 50 PSI. Seven minutes later, a mere seven minutes later, without cracks, splits, tears, breaks, creep, nothing, I took the same sample and I matched it on the reverse side second bend test. Seven minutes later, 325 PSI. Are you kidding me? Look at how it's coming back already. Look at that. Told you it didn't break. Look at it. 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 That was a complete bend. Look, 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 look. It's coming back again. Again, it's coming back. I'm gonna crack it open to show you that there's no tears or nothing. Unbelievable. That's two bend tests within seven minutes. Seven minutes, you saw it. If it wouldn't have popped off the holding, it popped off the holding. At 325 PSI, it popped off the holding when it was about 80% bent. Oh, unbelievable. Oh, unbelievable. I'm, I'm just shaking. I'm just, this is, this is, you don't know how big this is. This is so big. Look at that. Like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Look at that. Ah, oh, please. Please, show me a crack. Please, show me. Let's just take, look, look. Show me a crack. Show me a split. Show me a tear. Show me creep. Look at this. That's the second bend test. Look at it. Look at how flat that is. Look at how flat that is. Look at it. It's coming back already. You know what that means? I can do a third bend test. I can do a third bend test with two to three percent loss of strength. That's it. I can do these bend tests all day long. Look, there's nothing. People, there's nothing. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. No cracks. No nothing. Look, look, there's no cracks. There's no tears. Look at, look at how it's coming back. Look at, look at, look at, look at that. Almost back. And that's been what, three minutes of the press on the second bend test? Oh my God. All right, let's conclude this. I'm just, I'm so excited. Oh, I thought I, I, oh man, I was a little nervous there, and I feel so, I'm so, so vindicated. So people, in closing, there it is. That's, that's what all known material composites are today. That's it right there, including carbon fiber. I'm sorry, people. In the industry that do carbon fiber, I'm not putting it down. I know you don't want to hear that, but science doesn't lie. I've seen the actual bend tests on carbon fiber. It cracks, it breaks, it splits, just like that. That's what it does, people. The same with composite uh, uh, other uh, uh, fibers that are used. Rockwell, that do it. That's what happens. That's what happens on a bend test. And it loses all of its strength. Look, I'm not a material scientist. Oh my God, please, somebody out there get a hold of me. Look at, this is what happens to all known material composites. This is what happens to steel. It's not coming back, people. You can't use that again. It's garbage, it's scrap metal. Throw it away, okay? Now go to composite materials. Look at, look at, look at, forget splitting. Let's say it's great material and it doesn't split like this, like it doesn't come apart. This is what happens. You now have no strength. Here is Vulcanite age. Look at my baby, look at my baby. That's, that's two bend tests, people. That's two bend tests. That's, that's 
eight minutes out of the press. You think I'm exaggerating? You think I'm lying? I'm not. That's a second bend test right in front of your uncut film. The second bend test, I matched the steel. 3 8 plate, 60% lighter I am, and I mastered it at 325. The first bend test, I beat it at 375. Look at it. No cracks, no tears, and it's back. It's look at people. It doesn't lose any of its strength. You, you can't bend that. You, look, look, people, you, you, there's, there's no, there's no, there's nothing. On it. It's solid. I can put it in there and do it again and again and again, and it keeps coming back. That's Vulcanite H. Unprecedented. Get this to the right people. Oh, Rockwell, Lockyard, Boeing, 3M, somebody get a hold of me so I can send you samples and prove to you, especially in a tensile test, that Vulcanite, Vulcanite H, it's the new holy grail in material science. It's the baby. Dirt cheap, $7 Canadian a square foot at a quarter inch thick, 98%. Flex rebound memory ratio with a 2% reduction in strength. Fireproof, acid proof, UV resistant. I mean, people, no creep, no stretch, no tear, no nothing. It just, it's the wonder material. Thank you. Please, somebody.